They get chased by a bunch of boulders and are about to be killed. Then... <laughs> I knew it! I knew it, John Cena! Mr. You Can't See Me, man, was gonna go and save the day. <laughs> All you hear is... Imagine you're running from a boulder. Your life is about to end. And you're like, damn, this is how I go out. And all you hear is... What's that noise? It's John Cena. What's good, John? It's boy Ross back at again with another video. So we're going to check out 14 WWE theme songs that were used in movies. This should be very interesting. I um, want to see uh, what particular theme songs that they decide to use in what particular movies i love videos like this little tidbit videos or little little facts that you you know may not have known about so this should be a good one by tap out corner as always go subscribe to him link to the original video will be down below and let's see uh what uh theme songs was used in uh different movies he was beating up people as the anti-hero peacemaker or driving cars in fast and furious john cena was appearing as fred's dad in the fred trilogy of movies i forgot if about you don't this like was fred, the theme. you can appreciate this scene in the second movie fred falls out of his house while spying on his neighbors fred's father john cena then says he needs fred's help and the two rush out into a WWE arena for a tag team match <laughs> Wow. The arena, the reigning tag team champion, Brad wow. Father, Dad Not only do we get to hear John Cena's entrance music, but we also hear Gangrel and the Broods theme song. Wow. Must face their deadliest opponents yet. The Masked Vampire. Oh, they did have the Bruce Lee song. Dead partner, K -K 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 it's crazy how what? WWE vampires went from looking like this to looking like that. Remember Hardcore Holly? He had a theme song that sounded like this. Hardcore and badass set to go at it. In the movie Dodgeball, the main characters <laughs> are about to play a game of Love this well, movie. Dodgeball. Then, here's what happens right, when they see their now. opponents. Who's the other team? Uh, I have it right here, just a sec. We're playing Boy Scouts. Not quite. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I didn't know, I never knew that. I like never realized that. <laughs> well, this is one thing that Hardcore Holly and a group of little girls have in common. A WWE theme song randomly plays in the Chosen 22 survival thriller movie, Fall. In the movie, the two main characters are driving when one of their phones starts ringing. If you didn't catch it, that's the theme song of the legendary Road Warriors. Oh, wow. Going from Something live so action subtle. to animated, the movie Rumble features two WWE theme songs, and they both belong to tag teams. The first happens during a training montage with the hero of the film, Rayburn. He's fighting a giant dragon monster who wears a luchador mask. Naturally, this is the song that plays. Wow. <laughs> Yep, that's Sin Cara and Kalisto's entrance music. <laughs> but that's the only WWE song in the movie. Later on, the heroes stop their hometown stadium from being demolished, and here's what plays. Huh? Well, that was disappointing. Are you serious? What's the matter, boys? You show up, but no blow up. No red cups fell from wow. the sky, unfortunately, but it's still pretty cool. Too. I want to know, I'm sure WWE gets some type of royalties for that because they create most of their music in-house. So if it does get used somewhere else, they probably get some type of compensation for that. That's crazy. <laughs> theme song. Evolution is a mystery and a movie that's about aliens invading the state of Arizona. Towards the end of the what? film, the government decides to evacuate the city where the aliens are and destroy it. A very fitting song plays in the following scene. That's the same song that Bubba Ray and Devon wow. used to walk out to. <laughs> what? Why would they pick that song, though? The Netflix movie, The Main Event, features a number of real WWE wrestlers, so it's not surprising that there are a few WWE theme songs in it, too. That would the make sense. The movie's about a kid named Leo who participates in a competition to become the next NXT wrestler. The host of the competition is The Miz, who enters to his signature music. Yeah, that would make sense. Does it set in... In the main event of the movie, Leo fights a giant named Samson, or as you might know him, Commander Aziz. Their match is a special guest referee who also happens to be a Celtic warrior. Right, 
Going back to animation, that's, in 2014... That's literally crazy. <laughs> that's fucking insane. And I, I think Keith Lee didn't even play his actual wrestler gimmick, Keith Lee, at the time in the movie. <laughs> WWE did a crossover with Scooby-Doo in a movie called The WrestleMania Mystery. Not only are there a ton of wrestlers, but there are also a lot of wrestling theme songs. First, during a WWE show, we hear Vince McMahon's iconic, or perhaps infamous, entrance music. Mm -hmm. No chance. That's what you got. It would make sense. Excuse me, Mr. McMahon. They're called the WWE Universe. <laughs> Later in the movie, Scooby-Doo and Shaggy get framed for stealing the WWE Championship. However, they get the opportunity to fight for their freedom in a match against this man. <laughs> of course it would be Kane. Of course, why not? Fight for your freedom against Kane. Luckily, Scoob and Shiggy have AJ Lee to teach them how to wrestle. This wow. is back on a training montage, and we get to hear AJ's theme song. That's... Didn't even know this movie was However, a thing. the best use of a WWE theme song happens later in the movie. So the gang start looking for clues on who framed Scooby and Shaggy. They get chased by a bunch of boulders and are about to be killed. Then... <laughs> I knew it! I knew it! John Cena, Mr. You Can't See Me Man, was gonna go and save the day. <laughs> all you hear is <laughs> Imagine you're running from a boulder, your life is about to end. And you're like, damn, this is how I go out. And all you hear is What's that noise? It's John Cena. We gotta go back. Hold on, hold on. Bro, just... Killed. Then... <laughs> Stick a push back on Boulder, bro. Hey, they call him Super Cena for a reason. <laughs> Two years after the first WWE and Scooby-Doo crossover, we got a sequel with even more wrestlers and more WWE theme songs, like Rusev's. That's crazy. For glory of Russia. And the Miz's. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> However, the best scene with a WWE theme song goes to The Undertaker. <laughs> now you will. No. <laughs> Not the. <laughs> Not the bro with the eyes. He hit this to get with a super power driver. <laughs> Want to hear the rocks and boots to asses in a movie? If so, watch oh the Oh my god. <laughs> this nigga hit him with a fucking super pile drive. <laughs> oh, that was great. That Those last few clips were fantastic, bro. <laughs> I never even knew uh, WWE had a little crossover with uh, Scooby Doo, so that's. Very interesting, man. Very, very interesting. Comment down below. Let me know, man. What was your favorite part of this video for me? Just seeing John Cena save Scoob in the game from a fucking boulder and his theme song is playing. Mr. You Can't See Me, man. Doing, doing God's work. <laughs> But I appreciate all the love and support. Road to 150K. And I'm still the undisputed YouTube wrestling champ of the world. Appreciate y'all keeping me. See you on the next one. Peace.